Hello everyone, this is Harry from Direct Communication. Today I want to show you how you can install the TP-Link repeater. As you see, this is TP-Link access point and we're gonna install this as a repeater so it can repeat the signal of the router or extend the signal of the router. Okay, here I have I have the repeater open. I connect the three antenna and all I need to do now connect the LAN cable okay here here is the LAN cable I connect okay I connect the LAN cable and other part of the LAN cable I connect here with the PC here with the PC okay now I need to connect the power adapter and here is the adapter and I will connect at the wall the wall plug and I connect here is the on a button I on this you see the lights are blinking that means it's connected fine after this we need to configure configure this router uh, sorry configure this repeater if you are connected in the Wi-Fi 6 I need to disconnect and I disconnect the Wi-Fi for doing this you don't need any internet or nothing for this configuration okay we need to open network and sharing center and after change the adapter setting click the local area network of its properties we need to go inside the properties internet protocol version 4 click on this and right here and 192.168.1 finally 2 and after this click here and don't do nothing here and again write here 192.168.1 and finally 254 and click ok ok after finishing here if this come click public network and close and close all we need to check uh, our access point or repeater is working perfect or not go and click for example go and click at the start button type cmd it's command prompt make it fine type cd dot dot again cd dot dot ok now it's on the c drive now type ping 192.168.1.254 and click enter as you see this is receive, receiving the signal byte 32 time till 64 and lost 0 receive 4 that means the repeater or access point is working perfectly if you not see these signals that means your repeater is not connected fine so that means you have to connect and do that process again okay now all is fine we need to close this close and we need to open the internet explorer or the firefox anyone as you like go at the browser address address bar right 
192.168.1.254 okay click enter it will ask you the password and the the password and the user the default password and user for the tp link is admin 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 click enter here is the panel uh, here is the panel you can change the settings and all that here is the status this is the status don't do nothing here first go to the network and ip address here is find the getaway you must write you must need to write this getaway this is the getaway of the router my router or the ip address of my router is 192.168.1.1 you, you need to know the ip address of your router if you can't write here the repeater or access point will not work so be careful like this and don't touch this here nothing all is fine and after doing that you need to save okay and after this you need to click you need to click at wireless settings choose the choose the mode you want to use uh, i use as a universal repeater mode because i live in argentina so for me it is universal normal repeater is not working for me so i put at universal repeater the country as you are leaving choose the country as i living in argentina don't do here no, nothing now don't touch here and there nothing now click at the survey and it will search the network you have wait few minute here you see the list of the network sorry here you see the list of the network you can make it big and which wi-fi signal you want to repeat or make extend choose that one as here is you see solid like that is my wi-fi network and i click connect after connecting here is it will appear this is the mac ap access point address my address is 687 f74 dec65 okay after doing this you need to save click save and it will save wireless security mode you have to choose wireless security okay uh, it depend the router if your router is using the WEP wireless security mode for the password then you have to click here after this you don't need to do nothing all is fine close and you need to disconnect your repeater from the PC from the LAN connection as is working and disconnect okay thank you so much for watching and if you like this please subscribe and for more information go www.iscommunication.com thank you ciao